Welcome to this e-learning course overview presented by Visible Systems Corporation. This video provides a preview of the material covered in the complete course. For additional information about this course, please click on the link below and you will be redirected to our website with more details about the course. You can also contact us at e-learning at visible.com or visit our website at www.visible.com. My name is Joe Magid, and I'd like to welcome you to this session, Applied Structured Systems Analysis, part of the Software Engineering Methodology course. Before we begin, it is important to know what you should expect to have accomplished when you have completed this course. These include understanding and appreciating the principles and practices of structured systems analysis, to demonstrate how a structured approach to systems development enhances the ability to satisfy information processing needs, and to gain experience in using structured methods for systems analysis aided by visible analysts. To meet the objectives, we will put analysis in the larger systems development lifecycle framework. We will review strategic planning and analysis to proceed analysis at the system or project level. To meet the objectives, we will review rough draft system model components, which include the statement of purpose, an external event list, a context diagram, a preliminary entity relationship diagram, and also one or more preliminary state transition diagrams. And of course, we will also learn how to go about creating these constructs. We will also review the complete systems model components, which include again the statement of purpose and the external event list, a logical data model, a logical process model, and a data dictionary. And again, we will practice how we produce these components and learn various techniques to do that in a repeatable approach. Before we delve into the content, it is helpful to have some justification for why you should bother with structured methods at all. 